Okay, Gabriel, I will now show you the most important things of the outside check. Great. It's quite easy to summarize. Just check that there are no fluids, neither oil, fuel or hydraulic. That's basically the main thing, but we go in detail now. So if you want, we can start here, because we left the airplane on the aft exit. This is our life insurance, our engine, the left one. Make a visual check if no blades are twisted, any damage, any traces of bird impact, no feathers, no blood, nothing. What do you think? This part here, which I just now am caressing, how much of that one? Only this liner. It must be very nice. You can buy 20 new cars just for that single thing. So don't touch too hard. You have to check that those little holes are not um, covered by dust or maybe by tape. This little vein is to measure the airflow, the um, angle of attack of the airplane. It needs to be free, free to move. So The nose gear is so incredible because I flew 16 years on the A320 and the nose gear of the A330 is even bigger than the main gear of my former A320. It's great. We have a good... Uh, the oleo is not compressed so we have... Um, yeah, we have enough um, damping function on the nose gear. No traces of hydraulic fluid. No burst glasses, the tires are okay, not deflated, no cuts. No, no cuts, very good. Here we have the um, measurements, the pitots and the Roseman probes for the, the speed indication. They need to be free as well. No obstructions and it looks perfect as well, I like. Uh, when you look to the nose gear section, to the red ohm, you can see the closing mechanism. There are some safety latches, some safety locks. And it, it sounds like a very small issue, but if the maintenance is doing some work and not closing it properly, the red ohm may flew away or fly away. So just make sure that everything is locked, like on this nose gear. We need now activate our co-pilot to make sure he can uh, safely switch on the blue electric hydraulic pump because we need hydraulic pressure for the hydraulic system. We will now contact our co-pilot to give him hydraulic clearance so we get some, um, some blue hydraulic pressure on the blue hydraulic system. You know already our static pods? So these are the slats, so the forward part of the wings and if you hit some birds you will see traces of blood there. Just make sure no birds kiss the slats. Same here. Looks pretty good. Did you ever see a Rolls-Royce engine from the behind? So 
So let's now take a look on the main gear. We have some brake indication, those pins here, right over there. If they are flush with this white area, you won't have enough, um, enough material on the brakes. But those brakes, they look very good. So no issues with the brakes at all. Just make sure you don't have any hydraulic fluid. All your strut is by the limit, tight like that. Breakway indicator, very good. No cuts, no deflated tires, no hydraulic, no oil. I like that wheel. Okay, here we have again um, a very, a very large part of the sleds. Pay attention. But they are very clean, no bird strikes, no damage at all. So here the navigation lights, they need to work. We have two different ones. We have here um, the yellow indication, so the bulb is working. So this is now a very detailed check. If you look onto the lower part of the wing, you can see a hole, and in that hole, you see a white cross. Can you see it? If yes, that means good, because the tank is not, uh, has not experienced overpressure, so it's working fine, like it is here. Same for the disc of the trim tank, working fine. Okay, and now the big question. Gabriel, there's a red sign. You can see at the bottom of the APU, there's a very small red dot. Do you think it's good or not? Small red dot. I would guess that's good. Yeah, correct, it's good. Normally everything which is red is not good in aviation, but in this case, red means the fire extinguishing bottle is active, now it's working. So this is this the only case where red is good? We did now 95% of the outside check and we started here and we will end it here. So let's check the last part now for today's check. The left hand wing, the sleds look good, the flaps look good, the red nap light is on. Yeah, I think we can go. Everything is great.